All right, so we're gonna get on with our uh, unboxing video of this uh, brand new ATI Radeon, no, not Radeon, Fire Pro V4800. So, here it is. Brand new ATI, well it's not brand new anymore, but brand new for me, V4800 with um, DirectX 11 support, uh, one gigabyte of RAM, and iFinity support of course. And um, so here we go. So we open up the box and we get the iFinity configuration paper. Uh, we've got the uh, standard DVI to VGA adapter. Uh, we have a quick installation guide with a driver and software disk. And we have the creme de la creme, the um, FirePro 3D Graphics V4800 card itself. And so, that's the card. Obviously much smaller than previous generations because they've made improvements. Um, and the uh, voltage regulators. And it has a DVI adapter and two DisplayPort adapters. Uh, no HDMI, of course. And it also comes with a... Display port to DVI adapter. Um, I do not have a display port monitor, so I'll, I'll be making use of this. Uh, I use two uh, two screens. One is a, a 21 inch, one is a 22 inch, um, both through DVI on my existing Radeon 4870 card. So, uh, so this is the unboxing of this card. Um, pretty straightforward. Nothing special, of course. No bells and whistles. And this, of course, is if you. Uh, adapter upon another adapter if you needed a VGA cable. Um, I'm assuming, since I just checked on ATI's website, or AMD's website, there's only been one driver release, so I'm assuming that this has the, the most current version of the driver on it right now. And this quick installation guide... Um, nothing special, of course. Plug it in and turn it on. Uh, there is no, on this 4800, there is no uh, no slot, no additional power is needed from my power supply, which is very nice um, for me. Right now I've got a 500, uh, 500 or 550, I don't remember, power supply, um, and, it, and my current Radeon 4870 one gigabyte card needs two extra power adapters. And so using this card hopefully will give me some better performance uh, as well as save me some power in the long run. So and as well as some heat output. So uh, so that's the, the Radeon, or sorry, the Fire Pro V4800 from ATI, and uh, shortly we'll test it out.